Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. I guess this quarantine got me and everybody else thinking they could be a YouTuber. So I thought why not, you know, do one of one of makeup look that I've been wanting to try for a while. Um, so first I'm starting off my eyebrows and I'm using the NYX Micro Pencil and Espresso. I've probably been using this for so long, um, but yeah, my brows may look a little crazy right now, but don't worry, we're gonna fix them, we're gonna fix them. But this whole quarantine, can't go to the eyebrow lady, so my eyebrows are looking a hot mess, can't seem to find them, so I have to create some of my own. But you know, it's all good, it's all popping. Um, oh, and if you see me talking, I was um, talking to my friend about doing this. Um, yeah, so, yeah, the sense I'm probably going to try to record a separate eyebrow tutorial because, yeah, ain't nobody trying to see nobody make some brows forever. I think it took me like 10 minutes, and I don't know why today I decided to choose a different brush than what I normally do to conceal, but, you know, I thought I was getting creative and stuff, um, but no, it wasn't the wave, so... Yeah, no. Oh, also, I forgot to mention that I actually used the LA Girl Pro Conceal in Chestnut um, for my eyebrows. So yeah, it's been my ride or die for a hot minute and I don't think it's changing anytime soon. Also, I'm going to set my brows with the NYX Control Freak. It's like clear brow gel. Um, it's pretty cheap. I like it. It keeps my brows in place or rather the very little brows that I actually have. So if it works for me, it'll work for you. So now I'm just going to conceal my eyes with some of that concealer because I have really dark eyelids. So I'm going to blend that out and also set it. I've used the Black Radiance pressed powder. I'm not sure what shade it's in, but it doesn't matter because I actually need to get a new one. So if you actually know any, let me know because your girl needs to switch it up. Oh, also, I was just showing you the picture I was using for inspiration. I'm always on Pinterest finding these makeup looks that I'm just like, oh, I want to try, but I'm too lazy to do. So, I guess I found some time today. Um, so, I'm first going in. I'm using the um, It's My Ray Ray palette from um, BH Cosmetics. And I first went in with the color Friday. It's like this pinkish burgundy color. Well, not burgundy, more like a, a wine color. Um, since I thought I'd use that as like my transition shade but as you can see it wasn't coming up too well so I was waiting for that um, had to keep going over and over and over it and next I'm gonna take control no control Connie Connie so Connie is the purple shade in the palette um, so just kind of like start blending it in since the eye look is like a mix of purples and blues and like a little bit of like a light blue teal so yeah um so i also have been using my juvia's place palette which one is this the masquerade one uh which i love like i love this palette so much it looks so beat up right now like guys i had to wipe the thing so i could see what colors i was using so i was used chi which is the dark blue shade and then Dahlia, which is like a teal shade that I use more so on my inner corners. Um, so I've been using those from Juvia's Place. And then as for like the little white shimmer, like in the middle, I was using Angel from the It's My Ray Ray palette. Um, I never use this shade just because like I'm not trying to be looking ashy and stuff. But I guess I made it work just a little bit, just a little bit. It didn't matter since I wasn't going anywhere, but you know. Also, I've used the Better Than Sex um, by Too Faced mascara before I put my lashes on. And honestly, what I've learned is that you don't need no $20 la make lashes to be popping. Like, you'll see later on, I just use my cheap beauty supply lashes. They've been coming through for me forever. 
So I'm going in with Fenty, of course. Nothing other than the Fenty Beauty Foundation. And I'm in the color 450 the, for the Pro Filter one. I love this foundation. Before I found this, like, I never wore foundation. I was like, why? Like, I had a bad tendency to touch my face. But this, I'm like, I look so flawless. I can't mess it up. Like, no. So, yeah, I love this foundation so much. And I'm also going in with the Fenty Beauty Concealer, which I got in the color 420. I also like this as well, even though I have like fine lines like under my eyes. But it blends out well. It doesn't really move. Like it's popping. Like what else can I say? And now I'm just setting my under eye with um, Mocha from the It's My Rary palette. Just because I don't have a lighter powder to like set my highlight with. So I'm on the hunt for that. So for now I've just been using that. Um, and I also use the darker shade brownie to quote unquote contour. Or what I would consider contour because I'm not very good at it. But you know, I try. I try. And also just to set my whole face in general, I use my Black Radiance Powder um, just to get an even tone on my skin. So yeah. And now I'm going in just to smoke out my lash line. I swear I never do this because I don't know about y'all. But my eyes are always tearing up. Like, I live by the river, so as soon as I be leaving my house, the wind just smacks me in my face, and then I just start crying. Like, and what's the point of putting on under eye, um, eye shadow if you just gonna cry it all off? Like, no. So, but like I said, just for the purposes of this video, I decided why not? You see me going to put on my lashes. These are my go-to. I love them. If you ever in need of good lashes for the low, get you some Envy lashes from the beauty supply store. I guarantee you will not be disappointed. I've used them for myself. I've used them on my friends. Like I'm telling you, you just go from you just go from zero to one hundred when you put these lashes on. I swear. Like who is she? Look at that. Look at that. A baddie. Yes, this is what we stand for. Okay. And also a trick I learned is using a tweezer that has like points, uh, that comes to a point makes it so much easier to put on. Like, so much easier. And for my highlight, I'm going in with the Moonlight from the It's My Ray Ray palette. I don't really use this one that much, but since it kind of matched my inner corner, I was like, why not? But you know, I be glowing, I be shining. That's all I care about, so. See the way that I light hit that glow? Yes. Yes. And of course, I'm going in with my, I'm a gloss girl through and through. So I'm going through my Fenty gloss, my little glossy posse. It's like the white one and it has like blue shimmer. So it like matched the eyeshadow perfect. Like perfect. You know. She glowing. Ooh. And then I just set my face with my NYX matte finish. And that's the end of my look, y'all. Who is she? Ooh. She went from, she went to instant value. She ain't going nowhere, but she looked good. But. Thank you for tuning in and entertaining my shenanigans. So hopefully I could keep this going. So if you like it, like it, subscribe, leave me a message in the comments. Peace out.